Alrighty, here's a little update on the garden. Oh look, there's the elk. Out in the backyard. Oh, that's the neighbor's backyard. They just crossed through my backyard a little bit ago. So here's the hydroponic setup. My first attempt. So far everything looks like it's doing okay. This grow pot, everything split except for the last two down here. These two, um, one's filled with, I think this one's got iceberg head lettuce in it, and this one's got romaine lettuce. And this pod, the first four are tomatoes, and the last four are tomatillos, and then on this one here, the first four are pickling cucumbers, and then the last four are bok choy. I just checked the reservoir. The pH level is running at about uh, 5 5.8, 5 5.9. And the nutrients is right at 1350, 1400, somewhere around there. This is week number three, week number three, I believe, three or four. I think it's week three. That's right, it's week three. I've got a grow light that I'm going to put in here. Um, I'm kind of disappointed with the sunlight. I don't get, um, I only get sunlight, direct sunlight on the greenhouse from about 10 o'clock in the morning. When it's not cloudy from 10 o'clock in the morning to probably 4 o'clock in the afternoon, 5 o'clock in the afternoon. So they're not getting as the optimum amount of direct sunlight that they should be getting. So anyways, just a little update on the hydro setup. I was talking to my English teacher about this yesterday and they were pretty impressed with all of it. It's, it's fairly simple. It's definitely not new technology. Um, I would honestly say the hardest part about it is designing the, the plumbing, you know, designing the, the system itself and, and doing the plumbing. Um, I'm, I'm not a plumber and that's really where my hardest parts uh, came in was, was trying to get all the plumbing lined up. So, thanks for watching.